people have been driving by the Steveston Harbour Authority since 8 a.m. Saturday, all to buy a 20-pound bag of herring caught nearby in the Strait of Georgia. Now in its 12th year, the Steveston herring sale was started by fishermen in B.C. to honour the memory of one of their daughters passing to cancer. The proceeds go to the B.C. Children's Hospital, who says nearly $900,000 have been raised by the herring sales for kids going through cancer treatments. Everything that is used for the sale is donated um, from the, uh, the boat to the fuel to the skipper and their crew, their time. Um, to everything that you see. It's, it's all donated by the, by the fishermen of the fishing industry. And so 100% of the proceeds do go to the children that need it. A friend of the fisherman's daughter who passed has been volunteering at the sale for a few years. Despite the pouring rain Saturday, she's happy to be helping the cause. It does get me a little emotional um, because so many people, they don't get to live their life, you know, and that's what we get to do. And if it's hauling fish, then I'll haul the dang fish. I don't care. I just want to help if I can for anybody who's still here. Nakashima says the fishermen caught 20 tons of fish for the sale and they're seeing 400 cars every hour, showing BC residents really do love their herring and love supporting kids with cancer. It's for charity purpose, so that's, that's the main thing. We are coming all the way from Delta. Now, one question remains. How will people cook their herring? Fry, deep fry, or steam, yeah. Yeah, and sushi, like that, yeah. Basically, we uh, fry this one for eating, yeah. It's a very, very tasty fish. Baked um, with breaded, with a little panko breadcrumb. Um, and baked until it's nice and crispy. Beer says her words of encouragement to parents with kids who have cancer is to stay positive. People love you, people are trying, and I hope you can see that community cares. In Vancouver, Sarah Chu, City News.